And for me, I'm writing that. And for me, I'm writing that. In the front, and I'm one day about coming to a same. I'm married, and I'm cooking. You know, my life. Welcome back to the show. You're watching Prius. My name is Curly, and we are here in Stony Hill. Now, moving on with the show, we bring you talent on the rise. And this week's feature features an artist that's definitely on the rise. She's hot. She's collaborated with a lot of people in the business of importance. And trust me, you're going to love her. Jay Capri, welcome to Prius. My real name is Jordan, um, it's derived from my first name, and I'm a Capricorn, so hence J. Capri. J. Capri is an upcoming artist, she's talented, um, she wants to persevere and do what hasn't been done before. Okay, I was with a friend one day, and we went around Russian's studio, and I heard him composing something that was musically blowing my mind. So I wanted him to know that, you know, I'm a singer, I'm an aspiring singer. So he heard me sing. Um, I didn't hear from him for months. So I thought, you know, nothing was going to happen. But, you know, he eventually called me to do a collaboration with his artist, Shandizi, who's also a record label artist from Head Concussion. And we did a song called Nicest Feeling. It didn't reach where I wanted it to reach, but it, it really opened a lot of doors for me. A lot of people tell me that it's really hard as a art a new artist especially a female artist to like bus in jamaica and get that real buzz because usually you have to be doing something abroad first for for them to really praise you and appreciate the fact that you know you have a good song and whatever so i mean it's it's hard but at the same time i don't really i wouldn't dispute it because I like the fact that, you know, Jamaican people can be very critical. Because, I mean, I wouldn't just want to come out with a one-two song and then, hey, everybody's praising me. Like, I want to kind of work for it. I've been compared to a few people. Um, it doesn't really faze me because I know that once you go into the industry, you're always going to be compared to somebody. So I just try to do me and not let that get to me. The high points have been when I went on tour to Europe. Well, I've been to Europe about three different times, one with Child Black, one with Conscience, one by myself. Um, my favorite part was the one where I went by myself because, you know, I, I, I got a feel of what it is like to really be on the stage by yourself and get that energy from the crowd. I'm from Kingston. I went to Wilma's Trust High School for Girls, the best school ever. I really respect Conscience as an artist in Jamaica. He has done a lot, using me, internationally. So it was, I was really excited to work with him and the tours were amazing because the energy from people abroad, trust me. So I felt really, I felt really good about that. First tour was with Charlie Black. Um, I was in Europe for about a month or so. And we went to so many different places in France and the experience was just amazing. You can look out for Reverse It, that's produced by Russian Head Concussion Records. You don't know HCR World. I have a song on Stevens with him as well. It's called Little, that song that go around the place. Trust me, we have a lot of songs. We have a lot of songs out there. Yeah, love, oh, why reverse it? Just stand up firm, I'm a 
Yo, Sly, hold on, I'm up on TV, don't move a muscle. You watching Pre Days, we're going for a second commercial break. When we get back, we still have a lot more. Cool? Pre Days. <laughs> 